Hi student, uh, we try to answer question number 6. So look at this question, try to read the question. Magnesium got 3 isotopes, so magnesium 24, 25 and 26. The natural abundant percentage was already given. So how to calculate the relative atomic mass of magnesium? So we take magnesium 24. So 24 times with the percentage which is 79 plus with 25 times with the percentage 10 so plus with 26 26 magnesium 26 times with the plus percentage 11.0 and we total up divide with total percentage the total percentage is 100 percentage so we divide with 100 percentage and we try to find the relative atomic mass of magnesium isotope which is 24 Point three. Alright, so we try to check this question. So element X with the nuclear number 35 and the percentage given 75 percentage. No isotope of this element which is uh, X37. So we go for X37 and the percentage is given 25. And please remember the total percentage is 100 percentage and how to find the relative atomic mass of X. So we go for RAM of X. So we take 35 times with 75. Then we plus with 37 times with 25. Then we divide with total percentage which is 75 plus with 25 which is 100 percentage. So we put 100 percentage here. We try to find the answer. So answer 35.5. So the answer will be 35.5. Right. Try to check this question. Thallium consists of two isotopes 203. Thallium 203 and 205. So I put here thallium 2 203 and one more thallium 205 percentage of abundance percentage is not given so we will represent this one as y and please remember the total percentage is 100 percentage so here 100 minus y and the ram relative atomic mass of thallium is given ram of thallium is given 204.4 so how to solve this problem so this question so in the module so we can check here so we take thallium 203 times with the percentage which is y so plus we, we take 205 times with this whole percentage which is 100 minus y so i divide with the total percentage which is 100 percentage equal as ram and the ram of thallium is given in the question which is 204.4 all right so now we try to solve this one so when 203 times with y so i will get 203y plus this one we times here and we times here so we get 20500 minus 205y and we try to bring the 100 here so we put here 204.4 times with 100 which we will get we will get 20440 so when we take 203y minus with 205y we will get minus 2y so equal as 2044 zero and we bring this one here we minus with two zero five zero zero all right so the negative two y equal as negative sixty so y will be negative sixty divide with negative two so we will get thirty so y is known as thirty percentage how we apply here so the y percentage will be thirty percentage and ti two zero five isotope will be hundred minus with thirty percentage which will be seventy percentage Alright, so the answer is given in the module, so try to do more revision. So good luck for y'all. Thank you very much.